that's the primer throttle for the RC Spark Studio. I have a full-scale RC loader. Ta-da! <laughs> no driver inside. Hang on, we need a zoom of that. You wanna see it? Well, I can let the bucket down. Straight from Caterpillar. Unbelievable. Yeah, very cool, eh? Hey? I've run a skid steer for quite some time, quite a few years. This is the, the second time I'm using this today. It's the second time I've ever used it. It's definitely going to take a little bit of getting used to, but shoveling my snow will never be the same again. <laughs> By second time, he means he, he ran it for one minute. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, the controls are fit, like they're, they're the straight up controls out of the cab, right? So all I'm doing, this is controlling the movement left and right. This controls the arm and the bucket. So if you look at, I push left and right, the bucket goes back and up and down, right? So down, same with the arm. So if you push up, it comes down. And if you pull back on the control, just like in the, in the cab, you have full control over the uh, skid steer. Pretty amazing. The hydraulics as well. I just don't have any attachments right now. to adjust the arm. So incredible. We need a little practice. Everyday dude just getting it. Today I'm learning how to flatten out a jump. Tomorrow I'll be making a jump. <laughs> Feels so serious. It is serious. It is I'm serious. <laughs> That's what I mean. <laughs> there we go. Come on, dirt. Very nice. Up the arm. And back. Tilt it. And back. Tilt it a little more. Beautiful. I think RC construction is interesting. <laughs> I think this is so cool. <laughs> doesn't have a lot of digging experience so we're gonna get him to slowly take the skid steer back to the shop because the Sun is cooking us on the prairie today 
rocking machine, man. <laughs> yeah, you're that's right, exercise while you work. And they said being in a skid steer was an easy sit-down job all day. No more. Come lose weight and work today. <laughs> Want to turn it around? Woo -wee! What a beauty! It's uh, absolutely incredible. Keep her going. Back her in. Yeah, you bet. it down shut her down Woo, it's hot out yeah it is hot let's get in here <laughs> huh do you like that is that the feeling that you're getting when you use this machine we finally got one of these out here it's 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 whoa, yeah! oh my god <laughs> yeah you know it's terrifying <laughs> This is a full scale machine, has a lot of power, can knock down a home. When you're running a machine like this, we've got lots of safety uh, uh, precautions in place, of course, in the whole RC setup. And we are gonna talk about this more as I learn more about it. This is one of the machines I am studying, so I'd like to see more about it. Uh, but overall, I'm gonna have to give it a thumbs up. Duh, thumbs up, thumbs up. Yeah, we're gonna do more. And uh, guys, if you like it, you know what to do. Hit My back. question for you, hold on. Oh, well, I was doing an outro. But how did you feel about it? You didn't say how you felt about it. It was awesome. It really, <laughs> really was one of the coolest and the largest RC machine I've ever operated. Yeah. So hands down, it's amazing. So if you guys think it's amazing, outro time. Thumbs up, give us a video comment. And of course, if you were subscribed, make sure you follow along with our new videos. And uh, we'll see you in the next episode of RC Adventures. See you around. See you guys. Bye.